It's free it sits on top of a replica Liberty Bell. Clucking Bells believes in free range chickens. It supports its freedom. This is actually in all great. things. It proudly sits here as a monument and testament to those who lost their lives in 9-11. It was made from recycled material from the buildings. What a con on its head. Mr. Bell, the founder of Cluck and Bells, was unfortunately killed during 9-11, but he sacrificed himself saving two young children. Wait, if I say that's one huge cock at 30-17, oh, well, I get banned He left from now. the window using his own body to cushion the fall. Do I test it? The paramedics said his last words were, this chicken could fly. Oh! But... What with today's pandemic here? and everything going around, Cluck and Bells wanted to support everyone being healthy and safe. So, like any good responsible cock owner, they wrap it up tight and make sure that it's nice and safe. You can see the glossy scene on the outside to protect from the elements, as well as this cute little hat right there on the head. God, I love big cocks. Oh, me too. Yeah. We can be friends. <laughs> Sometimes I just stare at it in awe. I think, wow. Me too. I've got big hands. Nathan, stop talking. Nathan, stop. I have a question. Oh, no. Oh, oh sure. How, how much was that guy? Well, considering it's used with recycled parts, it really doesn't have a cost. However, the designer and manufacturers, I think he totaled about $30,000. Wait, I have a question. For a cock? I'll pay That's any price for, for, for that cock. Oh, well, if you're going to have the biggest cock, you demand top dollar. I have a question. <laughs> oh, please, go ahead. Uh, how, how, how big is that cock? I like go for like it 12 inches. It is massive. Just... <laughs> oh, Tara. Um, I think that's like a good, you know, six oh. foot cock. Ooh. I think, 